All right, so before we get started, uh, the first thing we need to do is we need to set up our GitHub repository uh, that will allow us to run and execute our GitHub workflows and actions. And so uh, the easiest way to do this is we're going to fork the course repository, and that's going to basically give you access to all of the code that's here, as well as the um, various branches that have been set up. Uh, so in the uh, description of the video, uh, there's a link to this repository. And in the repo, we're going to see the main branch, which is going to have the completed code for the course, as well as uh, various other branches um, that are tied to different particular parts of the lessons. And there will be a start and end, uh, so that way, if you're interested in one particular lesson, you can go ahead and check out the code from that point and work from there. Or, as you're working through the course content, if you need to um, compare what you have with what we finished with at the end of the lesson, you can do that as well uh, without having to dig through everything that was done overall. And so, uh, like I said, there's a few different ways you can do this, um, but the easiest way we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and fork the repo. I'm going to go ahead and choose your user or organization if you prefer. And what this will do is Git will create a complete fork of the repo, which will include all of the commits. It will include all of the branches and uh, everything's been done so far. And once you do that, uh, you just need to go ahead and have a way to work on the code. Um, so generally, you go ahead and clone the repo, um, pull it down, work on it locally. Uh, you could use the GitHub uh, IEDE to edit the files, whichever you're most comfortable with. Right, and once you uh, check out the code, uh, the main branch we're going to want to focus on is going to be zero uh, course start. Or if you're going right into Hello World, you can do Hello World start. And basically, it's going to give you a pretty bare bones repo uh, just with a readme and a license.